So tonight we're going to have Hush Puppy Crusted Pork Chop. We just took our pork chop and we put a little seasoning in there, some salt, some pepper, some celery, you know, paprika, that kind of stuff. Uh, season it the way you like. Then uh, eggs, milk, and then we just take it out of the wet bath. And you can mix up your own hush puppies however you like. If you have your own hush puppy recipe, um, I'm not going to do that in this. Maybe we'll do it later. But uh, we're using this uh, hush puppy mix with onion. So it's going to be a hush puppy and onion mix. And then we took a little bit of uh, bacon grease and just some uh, regular lard and mix them together in here. And we're going to get this up to a medium heat and we're going to fry this kind of like fried chicken. Make sure when you're coating these you're getting all the sides and you're sopping up any liquids that might you might see come through. I'm just going to add these to the pan. Once you uh, can drop some flour in, see a nice little sizzle. I just threw a little celery seed on top. I'm a big fan of celery seed and pork or chicken. Uh, so excited to be growing celery this year. Um, but you can season this however you like. Now you want to cook this slow on a medium high heat. Don't let it burn. It is going to take about 30 to 35 minutes. Could take up to 40. We're going to put the lid on this. Uh, brown up both sides and cook this until it's done. And I'll show you what it looks like when it's done. Now they say the good temperature for meat is 145. I'd say that's probably right on beef. Uh, pork and chicken I'd take it to 160, 165 up to 170. But once the internal temperature is at a safe temperature, you can take it off. And uh, the hush puppies are all hooked on the outside now. I don't know why you couldn't cook this in a air fryer. You might want to just spritz it with some oil or something or even in the oven. And this should work up this, the same way. Now another good thing that you could batter with this um, hush puppy mix would be fish. And then you'd have your hush puppies and your fish together. Now we're going to have a side bowl of this delicious looking uh, vegetable soup that my mom made actually. Uh, it's got some zucchini in there, some carrots, lots of corn, green beans, potatoes, and just a little beef stock. And then we're going to have some hominy. And we really enjoy our hominy. Hominy is just like a field corn soaked in lye and then rinsed off after it's swelled up. You can't burn hominy. You can cook it on high forever. It doesn't burn. The lye does something to it. And so it's been a real staple here on the homestead. Because um, it's taken a long time for me to get Tammy to realize the smoke alarm is not the timer. So we'll do a taste test on this, and uh, we'll let you know how it turned out. Back with the sheriff, and I better get out of the state fair. So I took off my pants, put on my blue suit, Mom packed up my stuff, and I left on the morning train. Well, that ain't much of a story. Oh, I like the part where he changes his pants. Yeah, oh, it's starting to get interesting. Oh, very funny. Ha, ha. Uh, <laughs> funny. But how long did Ma live here? Well, we moved over just after Pa died. Mm -hmm. 400 acres of the best land anywhere. wonder why she sold. Well, I guess a woman couldn't run a big spread by herself. Well, she sold the place and must have bought some money. What do you say we got on the bank? We'll settle up and get out of here. We'll split up four ways. Okay? Four ways? Three and a half would be more like it. Well, Bud's got to have his money to go to college, huh? Oh, I ain't going back to college. I'm going with him. Good. There's just one little thing you're forgetting. Honest opinion. You ain't been it's invited. Good. Oh, I think it was made by, but I don't Can you tell it's hush puppies and... One thing. I ain't going any place 
Um, pork chops. I can tell it's pork chop. Hush puppy, it's... Yeah, a little bit. But it's good. And it's moist. Didn't get dry. So much flavor. That's a winner. And I can taste the celery in there a lot. Right at the end. Very good. And this soup? Oh my goodness. Cauliflower. Where's the zucchini? Some zucchini in here somewhere. And look, not all crinkle cut carrots are from the store. They make little knives that do that. Poor rabbit. Did you keep records? We had a fire. Found it. But I can't remember every transaction. Good day. Reminds me of Homestead Aquarius. Looks like a frog in there. That zucchini. Mm. Mm. Every transaction or just this one? Are we making you hungry yet? Duke doesn't chew bones. Duke eats bones. If you like this video, hit that subscribe button. Hit the notification bell. That way you're notified every time we upload a video. Hit the like button and share this out with people you think may like it. Till next time. Peace, y'all. Ouch. Ah.